just finishing up the cooking of the soap. This is my morning brew. So this would be a coffee soap with, well, in the end, I'll add goat's milk and a little bit of honey. Uh, but yeah, it's just about done cooking. Once the middle has turned like the sides, it is done. And I will let it cool, add the rest of my ingredients, mold it, done, pretty much. And just like that, whoops, it's done. So I just give it a little stir. Kind of scrape the sides down a little bit. And then, mm, this was stir this. Take the temperature of it. So it's 180. I will let it cool down to about 160. And that is when I will add my scent, my goat's milk, and mold it. And that's that. Very simple. And we're back. I'm just going to give it a, a little bit of a stir. Perfect. That's good enough for me. So this is my goat's milk and honey. So pull all that in. It was frozen, that's why it looks a little lumpy. And a little bit of my coffee scent. I pour that in. It's very scientific. A little bit of this. Actually, it's... <clears throat> uh, just two ounces of goat's milk and what is it? An ounce of delicious coffee scent. And then mix that in really, really good, which I will do. And then I am going to pop it in the mold. So I'm going to mix that up and show you what it looks like after it goes in the mold. Hey, I see some water. So it's in the mold. And I put a little couple of coffee beans on top this time just to see how that turns out. Now everything in here I will scrape out and make what I call an ugly soap that will either get sold or used depending on how much I can get out of it. That's, so that's my coffee soap. Is that still hard? And this is one reason why I really enjoy hot process soap. <laughs> it is Lovely, bubbly soap already. A nice that frosts up. I love it. I enjoy making this so much more than cold process. <laughs> but it's nice. Well, that's it. It's a pretty easy process. Pretty straightforward. Takes about oh what did this take? It is what time is it? 30 so it takes about half an hour half an hour to 45 minutes start to finish and that's that thanks for watching